Hey guys and welcome back to the Maybelline Makeup Loft. My name is Bronte in case you were wondering and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get this classic glam look. Everyone wants to know how to do a nice cat liner and sort of go for that nice bold red lip every now and then just for the special occasion. So I will show you how I achieved this eye makeup look today. It is more of a smoky liner look if you're not looking for that super precise sharp winged liner. I've just decided I want to go for more of a softened smoky liner. If you're not already please subscribe down below. Like this video if you like this kind of video. Let us know in the comments below what you would like to see next and if you enjoyed it and if you would like to see how I achieved this look then please keep watching. So I'm going to start off using this new palette and it is the Total Temptations palette. It's like a highlight and eyeshadow palette. Ooh, look at that. And I'm just going to start off with this little neutrally brown shade right here. Applying that directly into my crease. It's like a super warm brown. Perfect like crease color. And just bring it out from the edge to the inner corner. Then I'm going to grab the cooler tone brown right here. That's going to go in the outer corner. In the crease though. Outer corner crease. Then I love the effect that a nice shimmer gives like the smoky winged liner. So I'm just going to grab this pretty gold color here. And I'm just going to do like a little sweep on the lid from the inner corner. Then I'm going to go into using the Maybelline Master Precise Liquid Liner right here. So I started by drawing the wing on and I started with the straight line and then the triangle down to the lid and then I sort of filled it in. And then I'm also going to use the Lasting Drama Automatic Gel 24 Hour Gel Pencil just to sort of give that better smudge effect. And then I'm going to go in and smudge it using the black shadow from the same palette. My eyes are hooded so they're always going to look different and liner doesn't always look as good on my eyes. But I do still like to rock it because I feel like it gives that extra glam look. I'm going to use the same gold here and highlight my brow bone because it's the perfect brow bone highlight. Then I'm going to use the same gold and just highlight the inner corner of my eye a little bit. Ooh, popping. For mascara, I'm just going to use the Maybelline Big Shot Colossal. And then I'm going to go ahead and put some lashes on off camera, so I'll be back in a second. So I ended up putting on some concealer and some bronzer while, off camera while I put my lashes on and waited for them to dry. I'm just going to quickly line my upper waterline using the same Lasting Drama Gel Pencil. For blush today, I'm going to use this blush here which kind of is like a super rosy kind of toned blush. Not something I would normally go for, but I want to be quite subdued and a little different. So this is the number 15 in the Maybelline Fit Me blush. It's, I think it's called Nude New. Just going to put that on the apples of my cheeks. And then I'm going to go back into the same Total Temptations palette. Um, and I'm just going to use the gold highlight just because I may as well use everything from this palette today. I'm all about those warm tones, so I'm obviously going to use the warm side a lot in this palette. I feel like the purple highlight would be really cute too. Then I'm just going to do my lower lash line. I'm going to use the warm tone and the same brush as before. I'm going to go for a really nice bold red lip because I feel like I never do red lips but a classic liner I feel like really calls for a red lip. I'm going to use the Maybelline Color Blur and it is in the color Orangey Glad. Really um, pinky orange tones don't suit me too much so I really like this one with a hint of orange in it. Then I'm going to go over the top using the, one of the new Vivid Hot Lacquer um, by Color Sensational Lip. And it is in the color 70 So Hot. Mmm. Oh. 
look at that. Then I'm just gonna go over the rest of my face using the Maybelline Master Fix. And then here you have it. This is the finished look of the day. I hope you guys liked this look. I do love a classic glam every now and then. And I because I got my hair dyed recently, I feel like when you have really dark hair, you even feel it more in the in the more vampy glam kind of look. So I hope you guys liked this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Let us know in the comments below what you would like to see next. And hopefully I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye, guys.